Today's short video is going to be about two key observations from Ronaldo's four-goal performance in Onassis' league match against Al Wada. One good and one bad. Well, not exactly bad, but it is a little worrying. Let's get on with it then. The good. Ronaldo's four goals against Old Wada was a reflection of the deadly striker that he was and still is, but only if he plays in the right teams. The last time Ronaldo had a team that truly played around him, was when Ole Gunnar Solskjaer was the manager of Manchester United, which was over a year ago, as opposed to the subsequent teams he played in, who merely played with him, namely Ralph Rangnick and Eric Ten Hag's Manchester United teams. What's the difference here? It's simple. Ronaldo needs to be the focal point of any team that he plays in, and although he limits the team's play style, he is still really good at what he does, which is scoring goals. Rangnick and Ten Hag's preference for strikers who fall back and press the opposition when out of possession is not in line with Ronaldo's style of playing off the last defender. Al Nasser is clearly willing to play according to Ronaldo's preference, and they got rewarded handsomely for it. So why didn't Ronaldo start performing like this upon arriving at Al Nasser? It's all because of one man, Talisker. Make no mistake, Taliska is a fantastic player and would still fit into most European top teams, but here is exactly where the problem is. The team has two star attackers without a clear plan on how to feed both at the same time. Prior to Ronaldo's arrival, Taliska was the focal point of every all Nasser attack, which is why he is also the league's top scorer. But Ronaldo's arrival meant a sudden shift in tactics that the team is just unable to adjust to. In the Earl Wada game, the absence of Talisca meant the team's instructions were simple. Fee, Ronaldo. And that is also why Al Nasser's game plan worked. Although Talisca and Ronaldo appear to be great friends off the pitch, they need to start clicking on the pitch as well if another performance like this is to be repeated. Do you agree with our assessment? Let us know in the comments below. And while you are still here, check out our sponsor for today. Phoenix Asia Academy and IEG Campus are collaborating with Glasgow Caledonian University to make MBAs accessible for all. Whether you are a fresh graduate or working professional, GCU has the program just for you. Click the link in the description for more details. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.